Welcome back guys, it is the last day of boot camp. It is week four and it's workout four and we're gonna end on a good note. We're gonna go through a toughie today. It's gonna to be the same as it's been all week. We're gonna be doing no repeat, 40 seconds on, 15 seconds transition time in between. Some ones you know, some stinkers thrown in there just to uh, challenge you a little bit more. It is the last workout after all, so gonna really push it this time. So we're gonna grab our dumbbells. We're gonna get started with some ski squats in 10 seconds. So ski squats, we squat down, stretch those arms out. Probably my least favorite exercise. And away we go. Next, we got a renegade row, so we're on high plank position. Pull up for the left, and then pull up for the right. 40 seconds. Keep the high plank to the right, try not to pike your butt up toward the sky. And away we go. We're going to do heel taps. So, done this one before. We crunch up, we reach around and tap the ankles. Tap the heels. And there we go. Up, up, come, up next. <laughs> Everybody's favorite. Knee, knee, toe, toe. So, we knee, knee, toe, toe. As fast as we can. This one gets the heart rate up and gets the, the head thinking. And there we go. Up next, we're going to do split squat with a pulse. So we take the dumbbells, we go down, pulse for one, two, three, then come back up. Right foot forward, left foot behind, and away we go. Burner. This one. Turn the glitch. And 
Close by ten. All right. Shake it out and we swap sides. Back foot forward, right foot behind. Turn and pulse with three. Let's go. Okay, up next we're going to do pack crossover. So hold the dumbbells like so, squeeze the packs, cut across, individually. We don't bend the arms on this one, we just squeeze the pack individually on each side. Let's go. Next we got side plank dig throughs. So we got the side plank position on the right side, feet crossed, and we dig through and back up. Okay, and away we go. Okay, up next, we got a stinker. It's a back lunge, high knee. So it's a little bit like the starter sprints we did yesterday. We back lunge with the right, knee touches the floor, and then we go up, and we're straight back in. Same leg. And we have to launch up off the floor, so make sure there's distance between the floor and your foot. Ten exercises in, just ten more to go. So right foot forward this time, lunging back with the left. Three, two, one, and away we go.
stuff. Whew. Okay, up next we're gonna do rear delt raise. So, tilt from the hips, lean them forward, heads of the dumbbells touching. Now we're gonna raise up like so. Keep the dumbbells in line with the shoulders. Make sure you're not tucking the arms in behind you. Straight out to the side. Keep that back nice and flat. Core engaged, soft knees. Right. We're gonna be doing jab, cross, duck, hook, hook with the dumbbell. So we go jab, cross, duck, left hook, right hook, and repeat. Okay, got it? Jab, cross, duck, left hook, right hook. Jab, cross, duck, left hook, right hook. Timed that pretty well. Okay, so up next you're gonna do a press crunch. So imagine a chest press combined with an ab crunch. So we chest press and then we raise up. Then we come back down again. Breathe out as you're pressing and crunching. Okay, up next, I'm just going to do the standard stiff leg deadlift. So, feet hip width apart, both dumbbells in hand, top from the hips, keeping the back nice and flat, pushing the back side out, soft knees, but they don't bend anymore throughout the rep. Now up next, tricky little one. Gonna be a single arm crossover tricep extension. So with that, like so, dumbbell in right hand, elbow into the crease of the, or hand into the crease of the elbow of the right, lower it down towards your shoulder, fully extend it back up. So from the shoulder to the elbow, does not move here. And you're just lowering it down to the opposite shoulder. And stop, and we're going to swap it over onto the other side. Let me just check in there we are left. Four exercises left. So, last one, three more. So, right hand, crease of the left elbow, lower towards the shoulder, really straighten back up.
next up. Uh, up next, we got a burpee ice skater. This sounds fun. So we're going here, we jump up, we get an ice skater over, then back, and repeat. Okay, and away we go. Ice skater over, ice skater back, and back to the burpee. Up. Okay. Alright, two more exercises. Can do the same again over the last side. Sorry. And away we go. And into a final exercise, isometric bicep curls. We did these individualizing each arm last time, but this time we're going to alternate. Hold the dumbbells up flexed, lower one down, and bring it back up and go with the other. Whew. The dumbbells stay flexed, you lower one down. Always under tension here. Whew. And stop. And that, my friends, is the end of Express Book Camp 2024. Huh. Give yourself a big pat on the back. Well done. Awesome work, guys. Now, thing is, it doesn't end there. That's not you done for the year. This is only the start. We want to keep you getting fitter and fitter and sticking with the exercise for 2024. So, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll get a workout anytime we drop one. And if you enjoyed that, guys, why not give, <sighs> excuse me, out of breath there, why not give Zeus Plus a try? Zeus Plus is our subscription service where we have all our programs laid out for you. Four week programs, five week programs, six week programs, all to be done from home using just a set of dumbbells. We've got a lot of people on there and a lot of happy customers. So click the link below, give it a try. Happy New Year and I'll see you next time.